Hey guys, welcome to the installation video of the Zeppelin mod. And I will be showing you guys two ways to install this. The old school way and the installer way using a mod installer. So go ahead and go to the form for the Zeppelin mod. I'll have the link in the description. And go all the way down to the downloads and click the first one. And wait five seconds and then click skip add and save it I'm not gonna save it because I already have it but you can save it and then go all the way back down there and get mod loader we're gonna need both of these mods to install uh, this so I'm gonna click download direct you can do it the ad fly way but this is faster and once you get here click save and you're gonna have it not going to do that because I already have them both. So once you have those, um, go ahead and go to your .minecraft folder. Which to do that, go percent app data percent and click enter, and then you'll get here, and then you can go to your .minecraft uh, bin, and don't worry about all the versions. We only need the Minecraft right click that and click open archive once you have once you get there delete the meta inf this is gonna cause minecraft to crash when we put mods in it so delete that and uh, open up a new explorer I already have enough so I'm just gonna go in here and uh, go to your mods where you save them I save them in this folder and as you can tell here I have a lot of mods but just go down to mod loader <coughs> excuse me and right click it and open the archive select all those and just drag them into your minecraft.jar and click yes and then go back into your mods folder and uh, go to the zeppelin mod right click that and open the archive and select all those and um, drag them in and click yes and now you're basically done but uh, to test it out I'm gonna install one more mod uh, which is the too many items mod um, so let me find it in this big list okay here it is too many items and I'm gonna right click that and open archive and do exactly the same yeah and I'll have that in the description too for download okay so once you do that open up minecraft don't worry about the weird logo I messed around with minecraft and messed that up but yeah um so put it in full screen and I'm gonna make a single player map and I'm just gonna go on uh let's create a new world and call it uh Zeppelin Mod Test. Okay. Um, and create the world. Okay, so here we are. And, uh, let's test this out. Go into our inventory. And here we are. Here are our airship control, elevator control, ship control, and turntable control. And, yeah, it works. Okay, so let's go and show you the second way of doing this. Okay, so I uh, restored my bin folder to a fresh copy. And so we can show you the second way. So go to your internet browser and go to Google and type in MC Patcher. This is the same mod we used for installing texture packs, but you can also use it to install mods. So go all the way down until you get to here, 
and uh, click any one of these. I like the media fire link. And you're going to have to wait five seconds. Click skip ad and you come to media fire and you can click on download. Um, and I will not save it because I already have it. Okay. So now go to where you saved it and open up MC Patcher, run it, and you come up to this. Okay. And just click the plus button and uh, add mod loader. Uh, let me find it. Okay, there. And add mod loader, click OK, and then add the Zeppelin mod and click OK, OK, and OK, and then click Patch, and you're done. You can just exit out of that and open up your Minecraft, and again it doesn't crash, and uh, let's go back into our Zeppelin mod test, and here we are, and let's check if it works. Um, uh, oh yeah, let me get too many items on really fast here. Um, let me open up MC Patcher and um, install too many items. Okay, so here we are. We install too many items and we can see if it works. Okay, and here we have all our controllers again, and it worked. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and subscribe, and comment for more.